Well, thank you very much for joining me today. This is a very brief introduction to Downstream Technologies Blueprint software. What I want to demonstrate here in the next minute or two is the power of this tool. In short, what this tool allows you to do is to greatly reduce the time it takes for you to create documentation. Whereas it takes many individuals or groups who are in the PCB industry maybe hours, if not days, to compile and put together their information, this tool can pull it together in minutes. It is also a powerful tool due to the fact that if you're in an organization that uses different EDA tools, you can use this as your common denominator, thus allowing all the other organizations to use whatever tools they seem to uh, enjoy or like to use. But at the end, you'll have documentation that is completely uniform. And I'd like to demonstrate this right now. So what you see over here is a template. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to import data that you would normally obtain from any one of these EDA tools. So I'm going to go into File, and I'm going to go into Import, and I'm going to click, in this case, Altium ODB++. So I'm going to click on the ODB++ folder. I'm going to press Open. So now the Blueprint tool is going to take this information in. It's going to crunch it. It's going to look at the net list. It's going to put things together. And in a moment or two here, you're going to see that it's going to populate those things that I left here on the template. Now you can see that we've, we're halfway through this. It's already brought up what one image that we have set up here. It's starting to put information to the drill chart. We're going to continue this, and now you'll see that it'll complete it. So now everything's done. It took that ODB++ information. It created us a layer stack up over here, which we can easily move around in case something got overlapped in it. We have our design over here, or at least an image of our design. We have the drill chart information. And if we scroll down, we can even put together panels. We can also put together those things that might be on other layers. So if you have assembly information on certain layers and you want to show the courtyards, you can certainly do that. Also based on the 3D information, which Altium does provide in this particular example. And we can even go down as far as to even have you know, a bill of materials added to this as well. So this is a very brief introduction. Feel free to contact us here at 9.connects. And thank you for your time.